Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back. Thank you so much for tuning in and I'm back again with another video. So in today's video, we're going to be looking at this device right in here. I don't know if I should call it a device, but this is a hydrate spark uh, steel smart water bottle. So basically, this is a smart bottle which reminds you when to drink water. But obviously, we all need to be reminded when to drink water, do we? I don't know. But anyway, we're going to find out how this one actually works. So this actually measures the amount of water that you take in a day and then if you need to drink water maybe a glass of water every hour this is where you can actually set it so if you keep on reminding you what it really like it you can actually connect it with your android your ios device your fitbit you can actually connect it with your apple watch which is something that's great it is bluetooth enabled device which actually works better with most of our bluetooth enabled device that i believe each and every one of one has one so let's read about this product so this is a hybrid spark steel which i believe at the bottom it has rgb light so basically it lights uh different lights and actually shows you uh different colors and then you can actually have an app that you download on your phone to actually give you those controls and the information so when you see on the side here when you start flashing the, the lights basically it's a reminder that you need to drink and also you send an alert into your phone and then you drink water you put it down it synchronizes the remaining amount of water into your device which is something that is great so like i said uh it works in with the uh, hydrate spark app uh, obviously which you can find it from app store as well as google play and then it's also compatible with uh apple health for those who are apple using ios devices so you can actually synchronize it with your iphone your ipad and then it works well with iphone uh, with apple's watch series 5 i believe if you if you have six or seven it should work and then it works well with fitbit so for those who have fitbit devices this will work well for you so let me go ahead and open it and then see how it looks like and actually what you could find in the box uh, let's see. there we go so the first thing that you find in here is this box i don't know what it is what is inside but it says open basically in different languages which i'm just gonna go ahead and do that open it and the first thing that i actually find in here i believe this is what an infrared sensor i'm not quite sure let me open it and see sort of like a charger or something but on the other end it's a usb cable that you usually want it on any usb a enabled device we're gonna find out where this fit let's put this aside and then Plastic, and then we get to the water bottle itself, and there's basically nothing else that you find in the package. So, here's the hydrate spark bottle, which is in metallic silver, and then it's written hydrate spark, which is this is 500 mil, or which is equal to 17 ounce in American metric. And I believe this is where the LED lights switch on. And then you can actually have like a, a strap for you to hold it like this. And this is basically where you fill in the water. So let's go ahead and see how it opens. Oh, okay. You can actually lock it and unlock it to drink. So let's see how do you fill the water. You have to turn it around. So basically, you're actually drinking from this portion here. So. When it's like this, it's open, and when it's like this, it's basically locked, so the water won't come out, which we're gonna test here. And what you find inside here is the quick start guide, which I'm not gonna go through that. There's more information. We love maybe customers, and then if you wanna give some feedback and have some chat, there's information that you go through in here, which I'm not gonna do that. So here's the hard rate spark uh, water bottle in here which I want to begin to start using, but I don't think it is... Oh, what? What is this? There's a, there's a button at the bottom, which I believe needs to be pressed. Okay, so I believe this is where you basically charge this uh, device so this goes in there if i'm correct and then once it's charged that's basically where you want to plug it in so i'm gonna use a power bank to do that and then i'm 
not sure if there's an indicator. Okay, there we go. So the lights start to flash on like that when it's busy charging, I guess. I'm not sure how long this takes. Uh, let's give it a few moments for it to charge. And then I believe once it's charged, then we can put it back in. While it's busy charging, I'm just gonna fill this with some water and then we will lock it in. I hope we won't spill any. And then we'll lock in there and pay it with the phone and then we can begin to test it. Okay, I'll fill, I'll fill the, this um, bottle with some water and it's not full. I'm hoping that this will be able to tell me the amount of water that I've filled in here. They said this is a 500 ml, so I believe this is half full, maybe 250. And then let me just take this out and see if maybe we've got some juice. Okay, I've got the app. There's an app that you can download from App Store or Google Play Store. Then you just sign in. I'm gonna use sign in with my uh, Apple ID uh, because it does allow to whether to sign in with your Facebook or your Apple ID. Uh, okay. Then it gets information. You can allow it to get information from your your Apple Health if you're using iOS like myself. And all that information was that you are going to fill. So I've given it access. It just picked up all the information. Then I'm gonna just allow. And then say okay. And then now it is on. And then it shows that I haven't drank any water today. So today's Sunday. And then add a bottle. So I'm trying to pay with the bottle. it from the bottle so basically this is the actual process I don't know if the camera can pick up but this is the actual process for searching for the bottle and then once it from the bottle it will vibrate and then to show that the bottle is paired and connected so I will just say uh, allow while using this then I will say about from Amazon say next begin my bottle is so it gives you actually different options so there is a 620 milliliter there's 500 there's 592 there's 720 the one that i got is actually this one here the 500 milli one which i'm gonna go ahead and select on it and then go next and then it says wait 10 seconds so let's give it time until it gets there it started calibrating the bottle and then done go next Fill your bottle, fill your bottle to the bottom of the thread, set it up on the thread. Do that. It says wait 10 seconds. Let's see. Okay. Done. Then it's some information on how you can actually use the bottle and stuff. I'm just going to click on done. And then it's obviously showing me that the battery is low and then I haven't reached any goals today. Obviously I'm starting to use this now and then I've got only one bottle and then I want it to show me. So here the goal, so you can usually set a goal of how much water you want to take in a day and then at the moment the default goal is like uh, 2084 milliliter. So I think that's like 2.1 liters so that you want to drink in a day so but what i'm interested in finding out is how much water is remaining so let me just see
Okay, yes, we got it. So it's actually updated. So the remaining amount of water is 355 milli uh, liters, which is quite great uh, as of 1621. So I can save that information. Then you can actually uh, set up for different things. So this is not only for water, you can do your tea, you can do your coffee, uh, you can do your energy drink. And then you can actually see how, how much you are taking that. So basically that's how this water bottle works. So I want to go to a place where it actually shows me about, um, let me see. Reminders, you can set reminders and then you can do that reminders. Okay. So, so you, how many times do you want to drink water a day? So eight, then what kind of reminders do you want? You can set uh, funny ones, motivational one, or quotations, and then you can choose it when to remind you. Should it remind you, always remind you, or should it remind you when you are behind? So if you have drank water, so it shouldn't remind you. If you are behind or if you are forgotten, then it can remind you. Then let me see. Then this glow. Um, um, so okay, there's a glow that happens at the bottom, which because I'm not gonna set it now, it will actually show you how the bottom the the bottle glows when it's reminding you so let's see if we can set that one up Okay, so the glow feature seem to be like a paid feature. I don't know why. I uh, see here you need to pay if you're using the pro, you need to pay 79 rands, which I'm not gonna buy. But basically, this is how it looks like, which I'm not gonna activate that now. I will see if there's a need for me to do that. Then I will share that with you guys. So the glow part doesn't work with all the bottle. So, but my I think it works with the pro. I'm not sure which one is the pro, but many say only for hydrox box too, which is which is this one according to the box. And then when you start creating, uh, let me see, it doesn't allow to save. I think it's because it requires payment. So it needs you to purchase the the glow, which I'm not gonna buy that for now. But basically, all the reminders I've set up to say uh, I will need to drink water eight hours, eight times a day, not eight hours, eight times a day. So every hour from between seven a.m. and twenty-two hundred, which is like uh, ten p.m., it will be reminding, sending me those those reminders. Then it should remind me every uh, one hour thirty minutes, so which is I think sufficient enough for me to have drink water eight times within that period of time. So that's it about this hydrate spark, which is something that is great. So I think the feature that I was interested in more into is the one that allows me to do the glow at the bottom to actually remind me to drink water. But obviously because it's a paid feature, which is something which I'm not ready to pay for at the moment, I'm not going to activate that. So that's it about this bottle. So if you're interested in something like this, which can actually send you reminders and share this health information with your uh, health apps, it's, this is something that you actually consider. So thank you so much for tuning in and I really appreciate your time and tuning into my video. So if you have any questions, just drop them in the comment section below. I will make sure that you address them. Be the cool guy, uh, drop a like, drop a comment and share this video if you can. I will really appreciate that. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.